What is going on there, YouTube? This is Gavin Nation's Time 2 speaking, and welcome back for part two of my lasers and VHS update for December 29th, 2018. And this is gonna be my only update for this entire year. So, and the last part, I showed you guys my lasers. So, so and I'm gonna, and it's gonna be the last part to, gonna show off my VHS tape. So, anyways, anyways, guys, let's get started. Get this started. I'm not gonna explain any full detail on one of these tapes, so I don't want I don't want to end up wasting too much time and stuff. So try and get things done as quick as I can. So so anyways guys, let's get this started. First we got a National Geographic title, of course. This is my this is my first unnatural Ge geographic title that we just picked up. March 27th, 1998. Recycled tape. Okay, put it on the um the twenty seventh week of nineteen ninety eight and the eighteenth week of two thousand four. In this is recycle tape. In this is two thousand four beach. Yes, I'm just want to just let you let you know, based on where I've got it so far. Got this because I usually do a lot watch the Olympics a lot, so I decided to get this VHS tape as well, of course. And that there are some pranks, but there's no printing on this tape yet again. There's no printing on this tape whatsoever. I also do on the the second of Scorpion King film on DVD, of course. Print on the thirty second week of Tian two. I showed you guys that I did get the um, the first two movies on lasers, so I did get the VHS of that film as well. Get the last installment of the Austin Powers films. And I also have all the Austin Powers films on lasers and VHS, of course, as well. Ear tape with the ink label and printed on October 15th, 2002. I showed you guys the original film on lasers in part one and also that the remake on VHS as well. Uh, print on the 15th week of John 4 and even those that John 3 VHS. So just let you know. And even those that John 4 reprint, of course. Finally had this movie, by the way. Plus, also the second film on VHS, of course. And I did get the get the Blu-ray steelbook of the first film and I am still hoping to get get all the Jason Bourne films on Blu-ray sometime very soon. Okay, pre on the the forty second week of Tian four.
a print on the, the 23rd week of 2003. And this is my this is my second um CBS um this is my second this is my second um um a Fox video tape that I ever had Copers with um CBS video of course. Print on the 13th week in 1994. Look at this movie for a very long time. So, so I finally had this movie on VHS. I had this movie on DVD plus I borrowed it from somebody else. Of course. Okay, prayed on the ninth week of 2003. You know, said 2 VHS, of course. So, just want to give you proof based on what I've got so far. Print on the 15th week of 1998. Oh, come on. Really? Hold on for just one second there. Got it. Alright. Decided to get the, um, decided to get volume one, season one of Sonic X on VHS, uh, because some of these movies, the, some of these videos were still going out of print one of these days, so I'm still planning hoping to get more sometime very soon. Um, be sure to pause and read some of the episodes on, on this, um, volume of the entire show, of course. A uh, print on April 10, 4. No printing on this tape once again. <sighs> and here are some of the bonus features, um... Here are some bonus features. Be sure to pause and read the information. Print on the 18th week of Titan 2. Damn it, what the hell? Got it.
Be sure and pause to read some of the bonus features as well. Print on the 19th week of 10 1. Finally got this is my first um this is my second key video on VHS I ever got and I'll be my first one which will be shown in another bit so and here's the quiller memorandum of course. You know, this is the nineteen sixty six film, of course. No printing on this tape once again. Finally had this movie a very long time. So I decided to pick this up, of course. I heard good things about this movie, so I decided to pick this up as well. Uh, print on the 30th week of 1999. Hold on for just one second there. So my tape would basically fall down. There you go. And let's continue. Hold on for just one second. Gotta set up my hands as well. No printing on this tape once again. I finally had the sequel on VHS to the original Fast and Furious. Plus, I also do own some of the latest films on DVD. Plus, I am still hoping to get the um, Blu-ray of the entire series, of course. So just want to give you a heads up. Uh, print on the 33rd week of 10, 4. Finally looking for a smoothie for, for a very long time. Even though this is the very first on um, the a direct video movie released by Touchstone Home Entertainment, of course. August 26, 2000, and even though it's the 1998 VHS. So just to let you know, even though this is a 2000 reprint, of course. Looking this for a movie for a very long time, of course. But I've just I I enjoyed I watched the movies plus I've enjoyed the hell out of this movie once again, of course. So I'd get this uh, so I'd get this movie on VHS to complete my entire focus features of VHS. And even this is this is the second um uh, focus features features so I'm ever to be released in theaters. Uh, so I just want to give you some information about that, of course. And here's the tape with the sticker label and print on the 10th week of 10, 3. So 
which is one of these movies that didn't get a DVD release, so I decided to get this movie, even though this movie is not on DVD yet, as well. Even though this is, uh, this is an out of print tile, so... Um, for a rental from an unknown base or N. Right now, there's no print date on this tape once again, of course. Printed on the 24th week in 1997. Decided to, decided to get this tape because I am a huge Purdue fan. Decided to get this um get this um highlight video on VHS. And here are some pranks, but there's no print date on this tape once again, of course. Hoping to get more Purdue um, football and um, basketball highlight videos sometime very soon. It's my second one ever that I ever had so far. Uh, for rental from Hollywood Video. The 36th week of 1999. February 19th, 2004, and this was printed on, uh, which is printed three months, um, after, um, after my, uh, it, I mean, I can't talk, printed on three months before my birthday, before my 10th birthday, of course, and even though it's a 2001 VHS, and this is a 2004 reprint, of course, so just to let you know. The 29th week of 2001. Another form rental from Hollywood Video. Just like my, um... Just like, um, Judas Kiss, of course. The three of we can ten three.
finally look in this movie for a very long time. It was it was directed by Richard Donner, of course. Uh, from Rental from Marsh, of course. I tried peeling this um sticker to 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 reveal the week in your code. Put it on the eleventh week of ten four. Uh, probably one of the earliest um screen gems screen gems film ever. Uh, I can't talk. Probably the 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 earliest um screen gems films ever made. Of course. Print on the the forty thirst the I can't talk the forty thirst week in nineteen ninety nine. April 22nd, 2004. Uh, purchase from Blockbuster, purchase on, purchase on March 20th, 2005. I tried checking to to make sure it was recycled from. It was recycled from under the Tuscan Sun, Town 4 VHS. And this this is a Black Reels release, of course. Oh my god, sorry about that. Huh. Put it on. Hmm. Uh, January 9th, 2005. And here's the Doctor Who, um, the, Del the Daleks, the Daleks, the Dead Play, and the Exp Expedition. It's probably the one of the, it's probably the William Hartnell years, of course. I decided to get this, um, get this, get some of the episodes of Doctor Who on VHS. Because right now I enjoyed the hell out of Doctor Who, of course. This is a two-tape set, of course. This is my second BBC video, um... BC V of each as ever released by 20th Century Fox. The other one is being, um, I'm keeping up, keeping up appearances with, from BBC video. <sighs> Both tapes print on the 32nd week of 2005. Okay, purchase on buck, purchase on block, uh, form rental from Blockbuster. Purchase on um, uh, February twenty second, two thousand six. It's my, it's my, it's my latest um, um, Blockbuster video home entertainment tape, uh, Blockbuster video um, tape that I ever had. Of course. And looking, looking for this movie for a very long time, of course. The thirty fifth week of ten four. Okay, this movie has gotten some bad reviews. Plus, I'm still hoping to keep this tape from my um twentieth century Fox Home Entertainment on VHS collection. And even though it's the white tape copy, of course, this is the this is the Hollywood video. Version. Plus, I ordered this tape off of eBay. Um, same thing goes to um swimming pool.
And here's tape with the ink label. And this is a white tape. Hold on for just one second. Let me grab my flashlight very quick to reveal the printing on this tape. Print on April 22nd, 2004. One tape almost fell. That's okay, of course. Just move on to the next tape, of course. Huh, another recycled tape, of course. On the 29th week of 1998 and the 18th week of 2004. And this, so this is a recy recycled tape. So just let you know. Even though said Chad 4 VHS. So, so just want to give you proof on that. On to the next tape, of course. It's my only MGM MGM special edition VHS that I ever got. It's probably one of my um it's my second Bond film ever first come out on VHS. But it's also had the um also had the entire Daniel Craig um, Bond movies on DVD. Plus, also had the um some of the early earlier films of the um Bond franchise on Laserdisc. So that so, so, can talk. So I get this um film on VHS. Even though I'm a fan of the Bond series, of course. And here's tape with the ink label, huh? Let me go reveal the printing on this tape once again. Huh. Weird. June 9th, 2004. And even though it's a 2 VHS, so, so I just want to give you proof on that, of course. Uh, finally looking for this movie for a very long time. Plus, I'm still hoping to get the, um, get the original, um, the 1998 original, um, Ringu on VHS. And this is the 19, this is the Chan 3, United States remake of the actual film itself. And right now, this is the, this is a very cool release of The Ring. By the way, this is the invisible, um, slipcover copy that I ever had. As well, sorry about that. Uh, print on February, I mean, February 6th, 2003. And in those say, Chan, I just I can't talk, I was incorrect. And this is the Chan 2 remake of 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 The Ring. Of course, I'm going to get the sequel someday. Um, just a fun fact. Um, here's, um, a Lara Croft Tomb Raider. Um, also had the second film on VHS. And I had, also had this movie on DVD. Plus, I sold it just to get this movie on VHS. And here's some bonus features. Just give you, just want you guys to give you, to read what the bonus features are for this tape, of course. The four if we could tell one. Looking for this movie for a very long time. So I got this movie on VHS. And right now I'm still not getting the latest release that film. Plus this movie is a very hard to find on latest as well.
the 39th week of 1999, and even though it's the 1999 reprint, and, and even though it's the 1996 VHS. So just to give you proof on that, of course. I'm looking for this movie for a very, another movie that I finally had in my collection, of course. Uh, for rental from Marsh, of course. Ugh, damn it, what the hell? One of, the tape, one of my tapes I'm still holding just fell. And that's okay, of course. And here's tape with the ink label. And um, this was printed on, on May 28, 2003. Uh, printed on basically, um, basically eight days. Um, never mind. Printed on nine days after my ninth birthday, of course. And right now it's gonna move on to the um the next year basically um it's basically this is basically a show. It's probably one of my favorite shows of, of all time. But it's also had the complete first season. And this is basically um this is basically um season one episodes of the entire of the entire Buffy the Vampire se series, of course. Also have season one on DD plus um this will basically shown in my entire DD collection video. On my channel, of course. Hold on. Just box out of the way. Huh. A hearsay with the ink label. Let me reveal the print on the tape yet yeah, again. December, uh, September twenty, uh, September sixth, nineteen ninety eight, of course. Hold on. Print on the 36th week of Um, the, um, the per day, um, the per day for part three of volume one of Buffy the Vampire Slayer is still ruined, unfortunately, of course. Hold on for just one second, I'll put these in the box, I'll put these back inside the box, of course. Move on to another box, of course. This is basically season two um, episodes of the actual show itself. Shh. 
the the 49 freaking 1999 for part for part one on volume two. Um, same week in your code as on um, part one for volume for volume two, of course. <sighs> uh, same week in your code for for volume two, um, for volume three, part one. I mean, for for part three, volume two, of course. Hold on for just one second there. Gonna put these back in the box, of course. Here you go. The 39 figure 10 3 and even though this is probably the very first on um, focus feature film ever made, of course. <sighs> I finally had this movie, by the way. Plus, I did get a chance to go see Split on um, the way back in January of, of 2017, of course. I decided to get this movie on VHS. Plus, I am still hoping to get the. I will be seeing the new ones, the new sequel to the original on Breakable, Breakable Film sometime, um, sometime next month, of course. And here's the tape with the stick uh, with the ink label and. Uh, prayed on October second, two thousand one. Hundred forty fourth day of nineteen ninety seven. The twenty eighth week of two thousand three. Uh, finally had this movie plus I got got rid of it for no unknown reason. Um December twenty first, two thousand. And this is going to be extremely rare um, for you guys as well. Are you ready for this? This is going to be extremely rare tape as well. I find this um, find this movie at, I find this tape at Goodwill. I'm going to count I'm going to count to 5, okay. 1 2 3 Four, five. This is my. This is a Chan Six reprint of the missing, of course. 
finally had Tales X reprint print of an an an, a, an actual Columbia Tricer Homer Entertainment tape, of course. Um, this was printed on um March twenty eighth, two thousand six. Finally, looking for this tape for a very long time. We got Spanglish. Another 5 tape for a very long time, of course. A uh, form rental from Movie Gallery. The ninth week of 2005. Another controversial film. Another movie that I finally have in my collection, of course. Got, got this in, in order to, to honor uh, Bernardo Berlucci, who also directed this film. And he also did pass away um, uh, sometime last month, of course. He may rest in peace. No printed on the tape, and this came in with um with other came with with an ad for other key video tiles on VHS. Aside the um side to own the um the first two of the Sam Raimi, a uh, Tobey Maguire, Sam Raimi Spider Man movies on VHS was also also had the shirt um which is in my wardrobe unfortunately of course. Um, here's tape with the sticker label and uh print on the the forty fourth week of two thousand four. Um finally had this movie which is directed by Robert Altman. It's my it's my final key video um, tape that I ever bought as well. It's my latest um, key video tape that I ever bought as well, of course. There's no printing on this tape whatsoever, once again. I uh, finally had the sequel on VHS. Um, um, I also, also had the original film on VHS as well. Plus, I picked up the latest um, movie on DVD. That that will be shown on my on my full version of my entire DVD collection um very soon, of course. The thirty third week of two thousand five. Uh, finally had this movie, by the way, of course. No week in your code on this tape yet again. Once again, um, same thing goes to Big Day and E.T. Plus, I got rid of for no unknown uh, for unknown circumstance.
No printing on this tape once again. Uh, finally has movie plus this movie's got bad reviews i'm excited to get this t a tape anyway for my entire collection and plus also like chevy chase of course the 40th week of 1995 A uh, former rental from Blockbuster purchased on November 29, 2001. Print on the 24th week of 2001. I uh, finally had this tape, and this is my first, um... Uh, this is my first, um, Family Home Entertainment tape that I ever bought so far. It's part of their, um, a Family Home Entertainment Theater, um, um, collection as well. I'm still hoping to get more, um, Family Home Entertainment tapes, um, um, basically released for Lionsgate Home Entertainment, of course. And this is my first one that I ever bought. Printed on the sixth week of 1997. I finally had this movie for a very long time, of course. The third week of 2001. Prayed on the 4th week of 2002. And here's some of the bonus features. So just want you guys to pause and read. And here's American Psycho. Finally has me for a very long time. And this is my First, I'm um, at Lionsgate Home Entertainment Tape, co produced um, release for University of Home Entertainment. It's my first one that I ever bought. Plus, I am still hoping to get more sometime very soon. The 32nd week of 2000, I mean, <clears throat> can't talk, print on the 30th week of two, um, the thirty second week of two two thousand, I was I was making up uh thirty week of two thousand plus it was printed on the the thirty second week of two thousand. My bad, of course. Here's the, here's the final tape um before I go to the um last box and some of the stuff that I just picked up just recently, of course. Here's the final tape for this um, update before I go to the last um, VHS box, of course. And some of the, the latest two tapes I ever picked up just recently as well.
Um, prayed on the uh, prayed on Ma March twenty second, two thousand four. Here's volume, volume one, um, uh, part three, uh, um, here's, um, volume three, part one of the, um, Slayer Chronicles on VHS. Put the, put my phone down very quick to reveal the print date on this tape. Uh, December 3rd, 2000. And here's, um, here's volume 2, part 3. Uh, here's, here's, on um, part 2, volume, uh, here's volume 3, part 2 of the, uh, of the Slayer Chronicles, um, uh, which is basically from the, uh, from Buffy the Vampire Slayer. One second there. Um, December fourteenth, two thousand. I'm um, for volume two. I'm um, for for part two. Um, and here's the here's the last part of the um of this entire Buffy the Vampire Slayer um the Slayer Chronicles on VHS box of course. One second there. December fifth, two thousand. And here's the last two tapes I just picked up just recently. I uh, finally had somebody because Rayo's. I also do like um psych psychological thrillers. I'm um, excited to get some movie for a very long time, of course. Eleventh week in two thousand five. And here's the last tape for this update. I finally looking for this movie for a very long time. Floppers, one second there. Uh, prayed on April 8th, 2004. And here's my update. Uh, here's here's part two of my update for, um, um, for, um, for December 29th, 2018. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. So, anyways, guys, until next time, of course. Um, this is Gavin to uh, sign off. Um, thanks for watching and have, have a good, happy new year, of course.